The 2019 Ramon Magsaysay Award for Emergent Leadership. Ko Sue Win. Koswe Win of Myanmar will now deliver his response. Vice President of the Philippines, Maria Leonor Roberto, former President Fide Ramos, trustees of the Ramon Masaisai Award Foundation, distinguished guests, members of the Masaisai family, fellow awardees, ladies and gentlemen. First, I would like to thank the Ramon Masaisai Award Foundation for giving me this prestigious award in Asia. But I feel deeply humbled by the fact that there are so many people out there in our country and various parts of the world more selfless, more honest than I am, but who have never been recognized for the services they render to their respective societies. I am the seventh person from Myanmar and the second journalist to receive this award. The first Myanmar journalist and one of the earliest recipients of this award is Mr. Adrup Michael Loyo who founded the Nation newspaper in 1948. That was one of the most influential newspapers in Southeast Asia. After the first military coup in 1962, Michael Loyal was jailed for five years and later forced to leave the country. Professional journalism had been lost in our country since then. The state of oppression which forced Mr. Loyal to leave his beloved country has relaxed to some extent following some democratic changes initiated since 2011. According to the current constitution, however, the military remains the most dominant force in our country, which controls key ministries and holds one quarter of seats in the legislature. The predominance of the military rules combined with continued and clashes in a number of ethnic minority areas and the rise of nationalism is the major challenge facing the independent media in Myanmar. This situation constantly instills a sense of threat into civil life and the news media. But having passed through various political and social turbulences over the past decades, we have developed a great resilience and a tremendous amount of patience for the problems in our country. None of the people I know in Myanmar expect changes to happen overnight, but we have a firm belief that we are not on the right path towards democracy and liberty as long as the supremacy of civilian rule has not come into fruition. In this contest, journalism plays a crucial role, the kind of journalism that sees the truth, that protects the fundamental rights of human beings, that is not color by pol political and religious dogmas, and above all, that is driven not by animosities 
against anyone or any entity, but by great compassion for the most unfortunate communities and individuals in the societies. Even though an independent press or press freedom is mostly a byproduct of a democratic political system, we are confident that the independent press can play a vibrant causal role for the growth of democracy and liberty in Myanmar and many other countries in Asia. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen.